course, I will take my time. I'll use the Inquisitor's medley. It's the most effective method for conducting an interrogation. Question. Pain. Question. Pain. Question. Pain. Hi, my name is Jay McLaughlin. I play Mortimer Madadine in The Inquisitor. I find that Mortimer has a very strong moral code, um, and it's a code that drives him no matter what, be it to, you know, to save someone or to um, or to slaughter them, I guess. Um, and what I like about him is the fact you, you may never quite love Mortimer, but you, you're going to like him and you're going to go along with him. Um, like you would with uh, any other sort of anti-hero. It proceeds as such, methodically and without emotion, until the desired result is achieved. You know, with anti-hero, you tend to think of someone making morally correct choices, but lacking morality or, you know, idealism and all that, you know, courage and things. Whereas Mortimer Madadine has all of those things in abundance and seems to lack the other qualities. Um, definitely lacks various social qualities that many people should have, I should think. Um, but the good thing is, as a player, you get to choose, ultimately, the direction in which you want to take Mortimer. I'll find you, should the need arise. Then we shall see the value of your oath. When you arrive, you see the character quite 2D, but as it gradually as, this, as the thing opens up, you really get to see the colours of the character. And, you know, because it's such rich, layered language in the script itself, you really get to see uh, Mortimer in a sort of more fully rounded way. The use of historical fact and language really make for a very believable and and well-rounded world that you know the player can get lost in and i really like it because you can almost sort of believe that this was our history you know you could you could almost believe that this is what our ancestors went through you know especially that period in the late middle ages which wasn't sort of the 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 nicest part of our history and you can almost believe that actually this happened and that's what i really like about it yeah um, there are challenges like speaking Latin, and my Latin is, is not particularly good. Um, so we, we do work on that. But there are other parts like, you know, the, the, the idea that Mortimer goes into the unworld, which is a very painful and uh, exhausting experience for Mortimer. And I, I quite enjoy playing those, doing those dialogues because as an actor, it's quite fun to play dialogue when the benefits only just outweigh the negative side effects that Mortimer feels. So the idea that he really doesn't want to go into this world and doesn't want to go through all this pain and anguish, but really at the end of the day has to do that. And there's, there's that sort of fine line where you just think, today, sh shall I bother today? Yes, I'm going to go and do it. And there's, it's quite fun to get into that. And it's, you know, it's quite emotional to do. I have no idea what those blades are. But there's certainly an important connection between them and Reuchlin's grave. Otherwise, I wouldn't have heard about them in the Umworld. We can't wait to see you in Kernigstein. When you play the Inquisitor. Coming soon. <laughs>